Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to add Google reviews to your website for free. You would want to add Google reviews to your website because people will trust your business more if they see positive Google reviews, which will eventually increase your sales. This is the output that we want to achieve. On this page, uh, the Google overall rating was displayed and of course the name of the organization or the business and how many Google reviews it has. It also displays the profile photo and name of the reviewer. We also have the star icons and the actual review. And we can also display the response from the owner and of course the view on Google link. Let's try to click this one. As you can see, we have the same information uh, from here. So this will really verify that the review is valid. And we also have the load more reviews button here at the bottom so that if, the, if your customer wants to uh, view more reviews they can do that all of these data are from the same Google business profile or organization profile here and whenever there's an update or a new reviews you don't need to copy and paste or embed any text or code uh, this feed will automatically update if you're concerned about SEO I tested the page with Google's Rich Results Tester and it says that it is uh, valid and it was crawled and uh, there's a review snippet detected. To achieve the output that I just showed you, we're going to use a free website widget called Sociable Kit. Let's go to sociablekit.com and sign up if you don't have an account yet. But since I already have an account, I will click login. And I will log in my account. It will redirect you to this page so that you can create your Google Reviews widget. But if you are redirected to this page, uh, you can click the Create Widget button here on the upper right. On the type of widget, we're going to search for Google reviews. On the drop down, we will select it. And then for the Google Place, we're going to search uh, the Google Place that we want or the Google Business Profile that you're going to use. And let's see on our example here. It is so there it is so we found a specific google place the next step is we will click the next button We will see a pop-up here that says the system is syncing your Google reviews and it might take a few minutes before it shows up. It will notify you via email or you can always chat with support if you need further help. Once your Google reviews shows up, you can now customize it using the customization options we have here. Let's open it. You can customize the themes, profile, the reviews. For example, we have a layout option here. Let's choose the carousel layout and click save changes. So the layout bec now becomes a carousel. We also have the moderation options where you can approve reviews the carousel layout options 
the badge the color options you can change the color of the text the background color of the review item the link hover color and more the pop-up you can also customize this one we also have the font options so one of the most commonly used op font option is the inherit option because if you use the inherit option it means it will the widget will use the font of your website so it will quickly match the look and feel but if you have a font of your choice here you can always do that you also have the text options where you can change the default text on the widget so you can change by default it is in English but if you're using a different language you can do it here so we have the button color options it applies to the load more button and if you know CSS you can further develop the look and feel of your widget so for this example we're going to use the a theme for example we change the theme here and for changing the theme the Google reviews widget looks very different so for this example we're going to use the um, masonry layout and the default theme of Maaliwala's theme so now it looks good you can close it after you use the customization options and now you can now copy the embed code by clicking the embed on website button here on the upper right so the javascript code it works for 99 percent of all website builders but if you're using wix you can use the link option so for now we're going to use the javascript code and click the copy button this code is what we were we will paste on our website so that it will appear like this if you're using an HTML or PHP page you can paste the code on the page where you want the reviews to appear you may open your code editor and paste the widget here like this so that after you save it and upload it to your web hosting it will look like this if you're using WordPress you can create or edit your existing page and add a block specifically an HTML block custom HTML block like this one and paste the embed code here and you may click preview to view the reviews you can publish it and view your page if you're using Squarespace you may create a new page or edit an existing page and then edit the page content Add a code block remove the default value and paste the embed code here click save you can click the refresh button of your browser to preview the reviews
If you want to add Google reviews on Shopify, Wix, Weebly, or Webflow, you can always ask Sociable Kit support for the exact instructions on how to do that. And for other inquiries, you can also ask the support using this chat box. And if you prefer email, their email is support at soci sociablekit.com. I hope I was able to help you add Google reviews on your website for free using sociablekit.com. That's it for this tutorial. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel.